So the Democrats just released a updated stimulus proposal. So we finna go over that real quick. The links to these websites will be in the description. Before we do that, make sure you send the like button to Pound Town. Y'all know what time it is. So right here with this first article, remember that the first HEROES Act was $3.4 trillion. The Democrats did not like that at all. So this bill right here is scaled down to $2.2 trillion. I want to say the Republicans have put out like a $1.5 trillion counter offer and then like a another a skinny bill offer that was like a few hundred billion dollars. So with this new updated HEROES Act, you got $1,200 for your second stimulus check. Notice it says $500 per dependent. You got $600 for extra federal unemployment boostment benefits. So then you have state and city aid support for small businesses. So they want to reinforce that PPP program, that paycheck protection program, funding for the airline industry. They love the airline industry. I think initially they considered it part of like national security or something like that. Don't get me the line, but if I, I think that's what I recall. You got money here for education and childcare. And then you got some additional items, some miscellaneous items. So like US Postal Service, worker safety, food security, coronavirus testing, tracing and treatment. So they wanna make sure everything good and all of that. So we're gonna look at another article right here that's gonna talk about some things that's not in the bill. So we scroll down, you'll see that it says not mentioned is student loan relief. So there's no student loan relief mentioned in the bill. Right now, that current relief is scheduled to expire on December 31st, so that's a couple months from now. That may be detrimental to a lot of people. So back in May, they passed the $3.4 trillion HEROES Act. The House did, but the, the Senate, which is Republican controlled, did not pass that. You had the $1,200 stimulus check, stimulus check in there, you had the $600 per week of unemployment in there as well. But they would have suspended payments and interest collection until September 30th of 2021. So it's kind of significant that they went from that to not even mentioning it in this new bill, this new version of the HEROES Act. So the Senate GOPs, they wanted $300 per week of unemployment. This is your Republicans. They wanted all these other things, but that's something to tone in on the fact that they wanted $300. The Republicans wanted $300 each week for a federal unemployment boost, but the Democrats are proposing $600 yet again. The Democrats came off of requesting student loan relief where they initially had tried to get it through September of 2021. So you got some kind of compromising going on. I know the Republicans felt strongly about that $600 per week of unemployment boost. So I wish I could tell you what's about to happen. I don't know. I don't even think they know. So I mean, that's that. So stay tuned in for your stimulus stuff. And hopefully everybody gets some money. And if some new updates come out, I'll let y'all know. Something else to consider is the fact that when we had all them record highs of unemployment, the Republicans did not want to agree to the $600 weekly unemployment boost. So now that unemployment more people have gotten jobs back and all this and that unemployment at like 8.4 percent i you can only speculate how much they're going to really want to agree to it now that you know the unemployment situation has gotten better and then something else that they fought strong on the republicans wanted this like unlimited liability protection for people all this and that basically making it so they friends we talked about this in another video their friends don't get sued for malpractice, essentially. The Democrats were not with that at all.
So the Democrats did not put that in this new bill. So, I mean, the Republicans got their good old stock market right now. I, I, I can't, unemployment is getting better. I don't know how soon this would be passed. I think stuff probably would have to get a little bit worse. It's unfortunate to say, but if I had to make a speculation, that's what that's what mine would be.